Hello guys and girls and welcome back to Two Point Hospital with me, Biffa. Thank you very much for joining me. So last episode, we did a bit of a rearranging here. Uh, we've added in more GP offices in this area, moved them from down here, expanded the toilets. Are you throwing up on the floor there? I don't think so. And move the ward over to this way. Is there a queue for the ward? Queue length four. There is a queue for the ward. I'll tell you what we could do then. Is let's spend some of the money that we've got and add to the room. Let's add some more beds in. Could I fit in there and there? I probably can't. We'll add two in because I need side access. Yeah, that's annoying, isn't it? We could probably fit another one there if we move that down. Can I just move that to there? Somewhere, somewhere there. Actually, if we move that... We don't need two of those. Um, let's sell that one. And then let's move that to here. So they can see you when they come in. <laughs> we'll have a bed behind there. Yeah, excellent. There we go. Perfect. Let's do that. So hopefully there's less of a queue there. Queue length zero. Good. That's what we want to do. Someone else has died. So what, what we're going to do is I'll add a few toilets in in a couple of spots. Let's just pause a second. Because people are... I've looked through my patients... And it checks what they're unhappy about. And there's lots of people that were... They've been here for so long. They're waiting in the queues. They're waiting for the toilets and all that sort of stuff. So let's try and just use some of this space that we've got. So we've got like a nice large sort of spot there. But we've got some little spaces down here. I'm just wondering whether we could add... We might as well just keep the thing going. How small a toilet can we add? Arthur Compass has announced winning the jackpot. We go like that. Hmm. I don't know whether that would work. If we just take out that, 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 and that, and try and put like just a toilet cubicle in there. Oh, it just won't fit. Yeah, just, just not big enough. Or we could go like that. I'm just thinking of just one little one in here with a sink and then a hand dryer on the way out. Oh, it just won't fit, will it? Oh, there. There we go. But that won't work. Build room not ready yet. Oh, a door. Well, I suppose that would help, wouldn't it? <laughs> Can we fit a door in? Oh, no. Can't quite squeeze a door in. Where could we put that? If we go like that and put the door against here. Oh, it doesn't like it. It doesn't like it. We need a bit more space. Seriously? Invalid corner? It's not an invalid corner location. It's... Oh, there we go. Right. What's wrong with that? Just not the right size. I think that's what it is. Yeah, I don't think that one's going to work. Let's... Stop editing that room. Let's just take a pause. So I'll tell you what we're going to do is we're going to try and use this space over here. So if we move these things to over there. There we go. We'll put you in the middle. Excellent. We'll take that. Put that over there. Yep. And then we'll see if we can put a toilet in here. Let's try that again then. Uh, where are we? Where are we? Toilets. I think it's got a 3x3 three three minimum, isn't it? I think that's what it is. Let's cancel that one. I'll tell you what we can do. We can do a test over here. And it probably actually says on the pop-up, I bet. Let's have a look. No, it doesn't. Yeah, 3x3 three three minimum. Darn it. Um, so we're not going to be able to squeeze one in, <laughs> in there. <laughs> unless we move... Unless we move this again... Which we might have to do. Because we can go one, two, three. Oh, we can't go three that way. No, it just ain't going to happen in that spot, is it? Unless we move the reception right here. Huh. Hang on a second. I'm having a think. Right, I've moved reception over to there. I think we can fit in a small little toilet here which would be very handy um let's go sink either side yeah hand dryers will squeeze in on the end there we go we'll get a couple of those uh radiator we'll probably need in a minute and then we can move that around just a little bit let's see if we go that way it's like literally right is that blocking the doors 
Are people still going to be able to come in there? I don't know. We could do that. We could sort of go like this. It's just like a really weird place to have it. But I'm just trying to use that space and have a little loo nearby that people can go to. I mean, then we can also add like that in and do something clever with that space. So we have a little cubicle there. Oh, they don't like going right in the corner, do they? Oh, that is annoying that they, they don't like that. How about the hand dryer? Hand dryer will go there. Well, this is interesting. How could we use this space? If we have that there, could we have another cubicle there? Let's turn it around. Yes, we can. But can they now not get into that corner? <laughs> this is like the worst designed loo ever. Uh, let's just pick that up and delete that one. The other option, of course, is to move one of these diagnosis rooms or even the research room. The research room does not have to be there, but I'm worried about moving it because we are 721 from 2000. And I'm not sure whether moving it is going to lose that for us. Do you know what we could do is a quick save and try it. I've moved it. We've still got the 721. Let's have a look. Make sure. Yes. Excellent. That's good. So what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to move this toilet. We're going to move this loo uh, over to here. There we go. Let's turn that around. Yeah. And then we'll make the best use of this space and make it bigger as well. There we go. Excellent. That is what we want. We're going to put a cubicle right in front of that window. We've got the door. We need another sink. There we go. Not enough hand dryers, but they'll have to queue for those. Excellent. That is what we want to see. Uh, let's just move that over to there out of the way. Good. There we go. So hopefully that will help. Wow, we've seriously got queues for the queue length six. Oh, and we need to get our... These guys. Let's just take a look what it says about you. Oh, look. Happy to see each other. Status queuing for the ward. Okay. Well, we could certainly extend our ward and we have some messages. Let's take a pause. Star promotion. Ready for promotion from senior janitor to head janitor. So he'll be quicker and better. More wages. Promote. You're getting promotes, promoted. Uh, staff training required. You'll have to wait. Clown clinic required. This is what we're going to do today. We're going to do that. Uh, get patients to wait. Staff challenge. Upgrade two machines. Oh, yeah, we'll do that. Uh, clown clinic required. Get patient to wait. Get patient to wait. Yeah, okay. Well, let's, let's upgrade a couple of machines. Uh, what could we upgrade? Can we upgrade these? No. Uh, that is sell. What can we upgrade? Let's take a look around. I bet these... No, that needs a janitor. This one? No. This one's been upgraded. Oh, okay. We've taken on the challenge. But we don't have anything we can upgrade just yet. But we will have once we have the clown room done. So let's do these things one at a time. Let's edit this ward. We're going to expand this ward all the way. What space do we need? Bed, foot of the bed, some change. And that can actually work quite well. So we've got one. No, we need to go like this, don't we? One, two. And then a space. One and two. There we go. We're going to need changing screens in here. We've got like a little block of six there. So actually, if we add another row there, that'll be quite good. We could then go like this. Have another little couple there. We can put a couple down there, right by the window. Yep. And then what else could we add? Let's have a look. Some plants. Keep the decor up. Uh, yep, there we go. How's the decor down here? Probably could do with another plant over there. Oh, someone's dying. That's not what you want to see in your hospital, is it? It really isn't. And then we'll get some of these. So can we put those like at the end of the bed in the middle of the room? Just sort of heat that area. One over here. So that's four more beds. I feel like we could utilize our space better. Make this even larger. And add some more beds down here. Just so we've got enough. Oh, that wouldn't quite go there. Let's go there, there and there. We move that over. Oh, yeah, there we go. Has that now got no access? Oh, darn it. 
We go like that. And like that. Yeah, there we go. And then we'll have another bed in there. Which is in valid location. Hmm. It's annoying when it does that. Well. Maybe we could... Oh, i tell you what we can do. I've seen it. I've spotted it. Right. This is what we're going to do. We are going to take that. Put it there. It's like a puzzle game, isn't it? We're going to get that in there. Yep. We are also going to move this bed to there. And we're going to have that changing thing there. There we go. So they can walk around. That bed can't go there. This bed will have to be sold. There we go. Yeah, I think that'll work. And then we'll have another plant. We'll have one there. We'll have one there. We'll have one there. Uh, the radiators, I'm not entirely sure they're going to reach all the way around there. So we're going to do this. And then we may end up with another one in the middle or something. Um, bedside table, wall monitor. What do these do? Increase room prestige. Plus one treatment power. power. That's going to cost us 125 to unlock. Oh, large radiator. Oh, that's something we might look at a bit later. Hand sanitizers, yuccas, cupboards, drinking fountains. Oh, there's so many good things here that could, that would be good for us. But we need to, oh, mountain painting. Increases hospital tractors from room. Yeah, let's put some of these in. Oh, it's not unlocked. Darn it, I thought it was unlocked. I wanted to go for something that's already unlocked. Oh, there's so many things. Um, Well, let's stick with that. Yeah, well, that's cost us a lot of money. Good. And now we need the clown treatment room, which can go in this area here. So let's just keep things rolling along. Oh, actually, a lot of these... Yeah, let's keep it rolling a bit slower because a lot of these people are waiting for the clown clinic. So it needs to be four by four. Good. Let's put a door in the corner. And here we go. We've got a big top. I am actually... Oh, upgrade our easy scan. Yeah, 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 yeah need to do that so let's fit some of this in and cure our clowns clown clinic prestige level two i think there's some more clown stuff yeah there's a cannon decorative item okay i'm not going to spend anything on decorative items yet or shall we festive and functional hey no i really don't want to i really don't want to i want to just keep keep my money and my things, these things. Uh, windows, should we have? Yeah, people can look in. Let's put some windows in. Because the windows actually give... Perfect for privacy haters and peeping toms. Yeah, people can look in and see what's going on. Oh, sweetie dispenser. Yeah, go on. Let's put a sweetie dispenser. That seems fitting outside this area. Build room not ready yet. Is there something else we need then? Really? Oh, the door's not working because of the sweetie dispenser. Because I'm an idiot. Okay, let's pop that there. And then... Yep. Yeah. Hooray! There we go. Whoa, plus 10. Earn kudos. Double digits. Excellent. So we've got 190. So we might actually... I'll tell you what we're going to do. We are going to unlock some items for this room. Because we want to make money in this room. So we're going to unlock the cannon... Yes. We're going to unlock the circus lights. Yes. And the hay. There we go. We spent all our kudosh. So let's get these in. We want people to love coming in here. So as you walk in, you're going to walk through some circus lights. And then we'll have a few little bays of, bales of hay. There we go. We'll put a couple over here. And a couple in this corner as well. A little area you can sit down on, perhaps. Like that. There we go. So we've got seven people waiting for this room. Um, and we've got a nurse that's coming over already. Well, let's see. Try to avoid death when possible. Try to avoid death where possible. Okay, we're going to get some of these in there. Look at that door as well. It's fantastic. Fit some more this way. Is that our first? Have we got our first clown? Here they come. I'm going to move that. That's like in the way. Can I put it there? Yes, that's fine. And we can have another bench here. I don't know why you're down here with your head. Oh, here we go. Look, he's coming in. Come in. Whoa, he's falling over. Ah, oh, the comedy of this guy. Let's... <laughs> oh, no. It's like, look how bad the world is. 
We've got the yearly awards coming up. Oh, man. Is he cured? And we got 10,000 for that just in time. That is the thing that we've been missing, is curing people of stuff. Getting right to the end of the production chain, as it was. Okay, let's have a look at all of these in one go. Open all. What do we reckon we're going to get? Uh, Rising Star. Oh, and Doctor of the Year. Awarded to the best performing doctor. Nice. Excellent. So that is it. We're going to start getting money now. Oh, you're struggling to get around each other and move about, aren't you? Let's, let's maybe just move some of these up to here. And we'll move that one as well. Just to give you a little bit of space. Yep, there we go. Excellent. So now we've got more people coming in to be cured. Oh, we're starting to make the money now. So I think you... Working in Clown Clinic. Happiness, energy, needs the toilet, treatment failed, thirsty. Yeah, we need some more staff rooms soon, don't we? we want to keep our staff happy. Security alert. Oh no, the end of the world. Ah! Things aren't as good as they think you are, BD clowns. And then we're going to make another 10,000. Hooray! Oh, that is perfect. That is perfect. So I don't know where our research guy has gone, but... So let's have a look in here. How many... Who can use it? Doctors, nurses, janitors, and assistants. Level three. Have we got anybody... Just everybody wants training. Yeah, we're just hanging five on that at the moment. I think we need a new janitor. Because we only have... Three janitors. Although, how's the place looking? Let's look around. It's not looking too bad. Look at this sad little bench in the middle. So psychiatry is the next thing that we really need. Look, 10 and 10. The GP queue we've managed to deal with, which is good. Because then our GPs will go and do other stuff in other places. What are all these bad hearts on here? What is that? No, I don't want the bed. I want the patient. Health zero. Health depleted. Illness difficulty unknown. Ah, oh, okay. So that's where we need to start dealing with those sort of things. Let's get... Some more psychiatrist rooms in and deal with that then. So, basic diagnosis. Oh, cardiology. So, we're not actually... We've gone from general diagnosis. Hmm. Let's do the psychiatry first. As we, we can see there's a big need for that. So, let's add some of those in. And we're not going to overspend on things. We're just going to put in a nice basic room. There we go. We're going to stick a lamp in because that's nice. Set the bonus. It makes the room look nice, doesn't it? Prestige level 2 on psychiatry. Excellent. Oh, go on. Let's add a treatment bookcase in. And we need a plant... Yeah, I think that will do. Do we need a heater in there? We'll put in a radiator. Just because. There we go. So hopefully that will start helping with the queue. Look, there we go. This guy's up against there again. And I'm wondering whether in this section up here, if we could move that door. Uh, there we go. Down here somewhere. Hmm. Let's get rid of the door. Let's put that there. And let's put in the door down here. Please fit in the door. Please. Oh, is it looking green? No. Oh, it's just not quite going to fit, is it? Which means we're going to get rid of that dryer. And then put the door here. No, it doesn't like it because it's a corner thing. Um. Oh, I hate it when it does that. I just wanted the door further down. So I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll take that and move that there. And we'll put the door there. But I want this as general diagnosis. Uh, not general, cardiology. Yeah, let's see if we can... Because we don't have one of these. See if this is going to help with our diagnosis. So we've got the heart racer. Diagnose patients. And hopefully get something a bit better out of what we're trying to do here. Let's do that. So that needs a nurse. Well, we've got nurses. We'll, we'll see how we go with the ones we've got. Still got a queue... Lots of people waiting around with nowhere to sit. So, well, we can we can fix that, can't we? Let's put benches everywhere. Everywhere that can have a bench will now have a bench. There we go. All the way down here. People hate standing around. Let's go from the corner and go like that. And then we're going to add in 
Oh, actually, that's not too bad, is it? Let's change that. Let's move that one up. And we'll move that one up. There we go. And we'll put a plant in there. Let go up against that. Perfect. And then maybe over here as well. Yep, squeeze that in there. That won't go there because of the door. It will go there. I bet we can get a plant in here. Nope, not quite. And then I want some more drinks machines. So energy drinks machines. Snack machine. There we go. Probably a radiator. Uh, let's have a look at how warm the rooms are. The toilets are pretty darn cold. There we go. That's better. This room does not have a radiator. Now it does. This room has a radiator. It does, yeah. It's just a slightly larger than expected room. This toilet does not have a radiator. They're going to be smack in the middle of the floor. Oh, do these doctor surgeries don't? No, they don't, do they? Patients are reminded not to be sick. There we go. Um, this hasn't got a radiator either. Oh, yes, it has. Just quite a large room. Oh, we didn't put any in the middle here again, did we? Oh, we got that one over there. Uh, let's maybe go like that. Like that. And then we'll take that one. And move that somewhere else. Um, are you getting cold waiting around over here? Can I squeeze that in here somewhere? Without making any... Maybe up against there. Okay, let's go for that. Oh, things are looking better. We're making money. What's this here? Star promotion. Yeah, anybody that wants to get promoted, you're going for it. There we go. Oh, what's this? Staff resignation warning has decided to stay. Well, thank you very much. So, we could probably now... Oh, look at that. Oh, it's looking so much better. Uh, we need another psychiatrist. I'm assuming... So, we have no cues for psychiatry, particularly to speak of. Do we? Uh, Q length five. Oh, we do. It just wasn't showing it. Q length four. Q length three. Where is the other doctor psychiatrist? Is he over here somewhere? <laughs> I really don't know. Oh, upgrade the easy scan. Oh, yeah. We need to do the upgrading in the thing, didn't we? Upgrade two machines. Um, Easy scan. Is that this one? Yes. Exploring past lives. Pick up. Oh, do we need to janitorise it first? And then we can upgrade it after that? I think that's probably what's going on. Um, do we have another... Where's, oh, can we upgrade this one? Janitor required. <laughs> Guess we're getting janitors on all of them. There we go. You're going to do that one. And then we'll upgrade to machines. Easy scan. There we go. Upgrade to easy scan too. Yep. We'll do that. So he'll come along and do that in a moment. I am actually going to hire another janitor. We are a bit short on janitors. So you are motivation quicker. You are good at maintenance. Yeah, we're going to have you. Let's have a look. Oh, upgrade the other one. There we go. Excellent. So that should be two machines. We'll get upgraded. We've got the, we've got the time. Yep, there we go. He's working on upgrading the machine for us. Excellent. What's this message down here? New illness, inflated ego. Ah, a dangerous buildup of narcissistic thoughts. If left untreated, parts of the ego begin to protrude from every orifice. Ooh, which is highly unpleasant for anyone nearby. A psychiatrist must carefully deflate the ego using a massive pin. We'll send the patient for treatment immediately. Well, that is interesting. So who is the one that's got the deflated ego, uh, inflated ego? Uh, you're going for the clown room. Mock star, inflated ego. There we go. So basically you need to go to psychiatrist and we'll get paid 10,000 for doing that. Uh, patience. Who is the one that's got it then? If you smell something suspicious, mm. please fill out four. Appointment, psychiatry. Board needs the toilet. Night fever, that's what I'm looking for. Let's scroll through. Diagnosis, night fever, mock star, jest infection, diagnosis, 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 night fever, lazy bones, mock star, jest infection, misery guts. I think we're waiting for it to be diagnosed and sorted. Mucky feet, mock star, diagnosis. Have we gone round the list now? Maybe. So lots of lots needing diagnosis. We really need more diagnosis machines, don't we? Seriously. Oh my goodness me. Well, 
we can... Oh, there we go. Look, they're upgrading the machine. We've done one. We can certainly afford new areas now. Oh, Freudian lips. <laughs> a tendency to pout excessively when faced with a camera caused by a buildup of lewd thoughts in the cerebral cortex. <laughs> also known as duck face. A, a psychiatrist must use a subconscious tap to drain the excess thoughts into a beaker, after which they can be safely disposed of in an incinerator. Wow. Okay. I should have a quick look at our rooms. Are we adding... No, we haven't got any of these. Fracture ward. So I'm wondering... Free training slots. Yeah, I know, I know. We'll get to that. I'm wondering whether we could go for some more psychiatrist rooms. That could be quite good. We also need to train some doctors in psychiatry. Why don't we do that? Uh, psychiatry. This seems to be the thing that, um, that we're getting here a lot. So we could actually pay for someone to come in and do it. I'm going to do that. So it's going to cost us 10 plus another 15. And then we're going to add in... Yeah, trainees available. So we're going to try and train some of our other... Student doctor, student doctor, student doctor. Some of our other doctors. There we go. In this. Yes, that'll be good. So start training. And then if we need to get some more doctors... Oh, we've done it. Staff challenge. Plus 25% happiness. An extra 10 kudos. Perfect. So we'll go with that, but then we do need some more psychiatrist rooms, and we do need some more psychiatrists, so I'm surprised actually, yeah. So we could purchase this section over here, I think that's a good idea, what's that going to cost, 50,000, and set up a psychiatrist area, because we are getting, we're like really short on doctors now, Let, let's just hire three more doctors, um, yeah, hire and hire yeah and we've got the money so we may as well hire do you know what i'm gonna hire all of them yes because we've got the money oh what's going on with you staff challenge get a level four staff room okay yeah let's do that let's get our level four staff room so let's just take a pause for a minute and take a look at this this staff room is pretty poor to be honest we could do with another one that is level three we could add another staff room up in this area and really make it a top-notch, really nice staff room. How about that? So if we take like a nice big sort of area like that and have the door over here. And then we could see we've got some stuff we can unlock. Dartboard? Oh, we can't afford that. Well, let's go with what we've got at the moment and see what we can do. So we're going to have... We can have like a nice seating area. Yeah. Like this. Lots of room for sitting and talking and, and stuff like that. Uh, could we put an armchair? That's Actually, we'll leave that like that. They can walk in. That's what we're going to do. We're going to move that to over here. How close can that get and still be used? Oh, okay. That's fine. Yeah, let's maximize our space. So just there. Perfect. And then we'll have a television here, so they can all sit and watch the TV. We'll have a lamp in the corner. And we'll have a plant there. That looks like a nice little area, doesn't it? We'll have a little bin on the way out. We'll have a radiator, so that will heat up that area. Coffee table. Yes, please, we'll unlock that. So over here, we'll have a little coffee area. So let's grab our armchairs. Will that fit in this side? Not quite. So let's move that over. We'll go. Which way should we do it? If we go like that. Get that as close as we can. I think it's probably because this one's in the way now. Let's move that. Where's it gone? Coffee table. Coffee table. Coffee table. Coffee table. There we go. <laughs> What's the matter with you? Do you have to go that far away? Yeah, I think it does. All right, we'll do that then. That's as close as that'll go. Yeah, that's fine. So you can enjoy the coffee table there. Very good. Ooh, arcade machine. There's lots of cool things. And we got some chairs. What else could we unlock? There's so much stuff. Eye test poster. We've got 10 kudos left. I don't think we're going to be unlocking anything else anytime soon. But let's put... Oh, we can't add an outside window. Okay, well, let's just put two windows there. Mm, do you have another lamp over here? Sort of squeeze in. 
Yeah, I can sort of squeeze in there. That'll be fine. Then we want drinks machines and stuff, so they can all come in. There we go. So we have that one there. Come in and get watered and fed and a snack machine. There we go. Perfect. I feel like maybe we need like a plant over here as well. Yeah, we can fit one in there. Excellent. What I'd really like to do is move that into the corner. Oh, we can't. Let's let's do some jiggery pokery here. That can go there. That can go one over. That can go one over. That can go one over. Yes. There we go. Where is it? Lamp. Perfect. Right in the corner like this one. Yeah. I'm liking that. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm actually going to move that over. <laughs> I'm going to change what I'm doing. Right, let's leave that there. Yeah, there we go. Nice little seating out. And do you know what? We could even add another armchair there. Nice little relaxed seating area. Build the room. Oh, look at that. People are going to love this one. And what is, th what is this? Level 3. We're almost at level prestige level 4. So what else do we need in here that is going to help? Sweetie dispenser. Yep, let's try that. Level 3 in a bit. So what does it need? It's not quite warm enough, is it? I don't think. Let's actually grab it from here. Yeah, definitely not warm enough. So let us add in... I don't know why I'm turning that around. That's going to go behind there. The other one's going to go there. Yep, that's fine. What's this one here? Let's close that. I think that is aesthetics or something, isn't it? This one? Attractiveness. Okay, well, let's see what else we can add in that's attractive. I mean, we could certainly add in a plant or two. Level four! There we go. We'll add another plant over here. Excellent. And we'll have everybody can use that. Nice. So we get a bonus for that. Thank you very much. Extra reward and some more kudos. Starting to get a bad reputation. Why is that? Chromotherapy required. Let's just pause a sec. Grey anatomy. Existential despair frequently leads to a loss of colour. Requires chromotherapy. The patient is seeking treatment. We will need a chromotherapy in order to treat them. You need to research a chromotherapy. What would you like to do? So we don't have that yet. Unfortunately. And we're still working on our research. It's just taking flipping ages. So I think, to be honest, we're going to send the patient home. And I'm wondering whether we could, like, speed this up at all. Let's just keep the game running. So let's have a look. Can I upgrade those at all? No. I could probably upgrade that. No. I can't. Oh, our cell... Shell project. No, we don't want to do that. And what about these screens here? Looks like the healthcare no. Could I add in some more screens maybe over there? Is in trouble again. If we move this around, yeah, that can go there. Just be careful we don't accidentally cancel anything. That can go there. And then if we edit this room, can I add in some more research monitors? Yes. Oh, no. I just can't. Oh, I was hoping I could. Um, what about if I pick up that and move it to here? Okay, that needs to go over. Let's pop that somewhere else. Let's move that to there. And we'll put our research monitor over here. Will they fit on here? 5,000. I bet they would. Uh, can I go somewhere else? Just anywhere would do. Okay, let's sell that for now. Yes, there we go. Extra research monitors, because that gives us plus one research power. So, I mean, you could really go for research and have, like, a massive room. Oh, what am I selling? Oh, why didn't that fit in? What? Okay, let's pause a sec. Hold on a minute. Yeah, it says they're fine. Yeah, okay. I don't know what it was. Whoa. Oh, with the plant. The plant has gone and the fire extinguisher. Okay, well, we can solve that. We squeeze a plant in. There we go. We squeeze one in over here. I just want this guy to be happy. Whatever he's doing. There we go. Because he's going to spend a lot of time in here. Fire extinguisher. Ooh, that's going to be against a wall, isn't it? Hmm. Hmm. 
I don't think we're going to fit that in. Let's maybe not worry about that. Unless this will go somewhere else. That one. That's squeezing somewhere. Oh, the door under the window. No, it won't. Okay. Oh, darn it. Sold it. Let's put that back in again. Attention. There we go. We'll go with that. But we'll, we're close. We're close to getting the chromotherapy. How's our training going? We've got 180,000. We're doing well. We could probably get rid of our loan. Let's have a look at our loans. Repay loan. So 29,000. Let's repay that. Save her the money. Save her the money. Oh, wow. We've got a queue for cardiology. Flipping egg. So, shall we move our psychiatrist section to over here? I think that is going to be a good idea. Okay, slight rearrangement of all of this. So I've shortened the training room. I've put the cardiology there. We've got this big space here. They're going back in for their training. Uh, rearranged all the benches and things. We've now. Oh dear! What was happening there? Oh look, they've been sick in the bins. No. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Um. Yep. Yeah. And we've got this area here. We've got all the psychiatry lined up. We've got nice places for them to eat food. Probably could just do with some more benches and things over here so let's do that i tend to try and leave a little bit of space there we go in between and then we can put in a plant or two yeah that plant will go there there we go sorry fella you just sat down but that's going to move up and we're going to have a leaflet stand yep and a radiator we have no radiators i think in this corridor so that's not good yes we have none here at all so can i squeeze one there no uh, that might have to just deal with being cold for now. Let's just pop one around there. Yep, there we go. Excellent. So we now have a new psychiatry wing to our hospital. What is the matter with you? Why are you so unhappy? Happiness 20%. Low hygiene, sniffles, nauseous. You're the doctor. You're supposed to be blimmin' happy. Take a break. Yeah, go on. Have a break. Have a break. Don't complain about it anymore. So we are making tons of money now that we've moved into this, which is fantastic. Uh, do we have... <laughs> do we have queues at all? Oh, hang on. Staff, 90 days to improve things for the janitor. Okay, well, we'll get back to... We're doing the training, don't complain. Yeah, we have no, no queues, which is good. So we're still waiting for this. It's at level three. It says the heating isn't the best. Hmm... I feel like we need this to be bigger. We need like a, a massive research room with... I mean, could we add in more research things? I'm wondering if we could do that. Like have a massive research wing. What's the matter with you? Why are you question marks? I think maybe we're going to do that, you know. So we can get this chromotherapy done. Let us edit that. Move it over here. Go like that. Yeah, here we go. This is it. This room's going to be the best room ever. We're going to add to that. There we go. Then we're going to add in... Can we have another research pod? No, we can't. So if we get these... How about that for a research room? There we go. We've kept the research. Thank goodness for that. We're like maxing this thing out. I think that looks good. So I don't know whether... Does it give us like an overall... Still level four. Oh, what's this down here? Revenue. Oh, we're doing okay. We, we just spent some money, but that's fine. Uh, happiness is 20%. Current happiness is 5%. Oh, Vince Peeble Threat. Uh, make your member happy. Vince. Oh, he's so unhappy. Maybe we could give him a pay review. Let's have a look. Let's see if we can find... Oh, his energy is so low. <laughs> uh, let's see if we can find him on here. There we go. Vince Peeble. He's unhappy with his wage. Let's... Get him. Man, he's going to be like the highest paid. Let's go to that. And see whether that 
helps. What is he at? 6%. Flipping heck. Oh, you're very unhappy as well. Let's up, let's up all of these. Do you know what? We should really go through our staff. Because we want to keep our staff... Yeah, we'll have to pause that. We want to keep our staff at least... Stop jumping around. I've paused the game. Okay, we'll do it this way. At least sort of, you know, that face. <laughs> Which isn't ecstatically happy, but it's not seriously unhappy. Wow, you're so unhappy. Vince, I'm so sorry. There we go. What up you? So I think... That was everybody. Let's go back to Vince. Let's see if there's anything else we could do to help him. Take a break. Yes. Let him take a break. And he's had a pay review. And let's see what happens. If he ends up leaving, then there's not much we can do about that, is there? There we go. We're so close. 1974, 75, 76. Wouldn't you love to work in a room like this? Look at that. Look at all those screens. You're certainly not going to get I8 looking at the Matrix, are you? Fantastic. Is he nearly done? 1998, 2000! Hooray! <laughs> So, we can now use that all over the place. We need to have research project completed, upgraded chromotherapy, output colorizer 2. So, we are going to work on that in the next episode. We want to pick another research. Why does it only say 114 out of... Well, I don't know. We finished it anyway. Pest control. We haven't got a problem with that. Advanced upgraded chromotherapy. Okay, recovery room. To recombobulate patients suffering from cubism. So there's stuff here that we don't need yet. Oh, DNA, shock clinic, fluid analysis. To extract a range of fluids from patients for diagnosis purposes. Oh, okay. So things like that would be handy. Injection room. Injection patients without touching them. Mega scan. Oh, wow. Y rays as well as X rays. So anything that makes diagnosis better would be good. Premature mummification, head office, cure people with turtle heads, <laughs> X ray, revolutionize patient diagnosis, V rays and W rays. Oh my goodness. Resolution lab to up res a person and training research. New research methods to help us train even better researchers. Wow, there's so much stuff. What do you reckon we should go for next? Let me know. Hit the big B with the tea stain to subscribe. Be back here tomorrow. We are going to be putting in our new room. Where is it? Chromotherapy. I'll find it. It'll be somewhere. And I'll look forward to that. And I will see you then. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye. There we go. Rewards colorizer too. Perfect.